Parker's one of those special places. You know, we've got the desert, we've got the river. It's a bit of an oasis. It's a place that's got the most rugged, brutal terrain on the planet, but on the flip side, it's got one of the most serene places you've ever seen on the river, and it makes it special. People want to come here, people want to compete here, people want to win here. This community is just 100% pro off-road. It brings people here and they come back and they use the river. Life revolves around off-road when you live in Parker. So we bought uh, a car aptly named the Mona Lisa. You know, it's a work of art. You know, obviously anything named after a Da Vinci, you know, is damn fast. I'm really excited about this car. It's one of the winningest uh, desert cars ever built. And I think uh, 2021 is definitely gonna be a special year for us. It's really unlike a lot of UTVs ever built. And, you know, driving it the first time, it's, it's basically like a class one car. It's not really, a UTV chassis, it's an all chromoly chassis. It's got obviously a Polaris Razor engine and, and the bones of it are Polaris Razor, but this car was built specifically to go fast in the desert, you know? And I think that's one thing that's, you know, makes it stand out ahead of everything else. So racing's been in my family's blood. I mean, my great-grandfather was an accomplished horse racer. My grandpa's one of the most accomplished boat racers of all time. My dad spent 40 years doing battle with the best in off-road racing. My dad, he was involved in the first off-road races ever. He, although he was a boat racer, he knew what was good for this community. It's really tough to finish a race. It's really tough to win a race, but when you've got 50 years of history to rely on and that data and that knowledge, and it's, uh, it's definitely an advantage come race time. Don't confuse things here. When I get behind the wheel, and especially in this new car, we're coming for you.